Hey everyone, Go Bots here back today with a brand new episode for MLB The Show 19 Franchise Mode with the Texas Rangers. We're coming into a rivalry series against the Houston Astros. Both teams right now at 10-8. and 8, and Currently the Rangers a game out of the division, the AL West, uh, against the Mariners, 13-9. and 9. So we're going to pick up where we left off. Today will be more of a sim episode where we're going to try to cover some ground and get done with April by going and doing quick manage and other simulation a little bit and just try to speed up the process a little bit. But if you enjoy the content, as always, make sure you leave a huge thumbs up on today's video. Comment down below with your feedback, tips, and suggestions. And if you want to see more, click the notification and subscribe buttons so you never miss out on any future videos here on the channel and you help us reach towards our growing goal of 2,000 subscribers. Also, for streaming purposes, go follow me on twitch.tv forward slash gobotchgaming and here for all streaming content on those two areas but we're going to jump in here today y'all again we're making this more of a sim episode today so we're going to do quick manage a lot uh we're just trying to speed it up a little bit and get through april and see where we kind of stand uh we got lance lynn on the mound he's been doing pretty good for us overall we moved out bandy and put in mathis at the starting catcher position just trying to see if we can get something going there but we're getting things going here altuve on with a two out single and the Rangers go down almost in order. Elvis got the single there. So we're in the middle of the lineup now. There's another two-out single from Springer. Steals a base. Ground out in the half inning. And Odor on with a leadoff walk. Strikeout from Cabrera. There's a double play inning over. So nothing going for the Rangers. Or the Astros right now. Altuve, though, with a leadoff single. Stolen base. A pinch runner. Kemp coming on. I wonder if Altuve got hurt right there. Very intriguing. And we get out of the inning, so... Works out in our favor. Chew aboard now for the Rangers. Fielder's choice now. Elvis on. And a single. We have a runner in the corners now for Odor, who hits into a double play, and that ends the inning. Unfortunately, the Rangers strand him. And we got two on now with one away. Lynn got to get out of the situation, and he does. And now the Rangers, bottom of the lineup. Nothing going. Heading to the sixth now, and Lynn sends him down in order. And a solo home run for the Rangers. Shinsu Chu sends it and makes this a 1-0 game. And the Rangers with a 1-0 lead will take it. And we got to watch out here for Lynn. We're in a tricky situation. See, can he get out of this inning? And he does. Good job on Lynn right there. Can bring in Chris Stavinsky now for the Astros. And he comes in and he does what he should. And we're going to go pitching change, bring in Kimbrell. Our newly acquired reliever that we got off the free agency. And Correa reaches on a error, but that's all they have there. Joe Smith now brought in for the Astros, and he comes in and he does his job. So now we've got to bring in the closer, Leclerc. Walks the leadoff hitter. Caught stealing, though, and it works out in our favor, and the Rangers will win this one. 1-0. One, Lance Lynn, seven strong, three hits, no earned runs with four walks and six strikeouts. Now improving to 3-1 on the year with a 4.18 ERA, and Leclerc with his sixth save as we get ready now and we move on to game two in the series against the Astros. So again, good pitching right there going on for the Rangers. Uh, did I do quick manage? I didn't know if I did quick manage. Hold on. Sometimes I freak myself out with that. Okay. Yes. Quick manage. Yes. Okay. We're good. All right. So we got Shelby Miller on the bump today for the Rangers. Is that right? Base 2-0. Oh. Let's do it. Miller on the bump. See if he can have a good Game so far two on. There's a bases loaded situation. Springer strikes out. And the Rangers go down on order. And another bad situation. One comes in there for the Astros. one nothing lead. And the Rangers really can't get anything going here. We're struggling right now with the walks. Going against Colin McHugh here. And he's just sending us down in order, man. Not doing anything against him. And now we need to get something going here. Middle of the lineup, nothing. Man, nothing going for the Rangers in this series offensively. I mean, we've had one run. And we're just keep getting belted right now. Shelby Miller still doing his thing to help us out. Guzman with a one single, but nothing else going for the Rangers. And now a double leads this thing off. We're going to go pitching change, bring in Matt Bush, who walks. Oh, fielder's choice in the ground out, out of the inning. And Elvis Andrus, the Rangers have a man on. A two-run home run from Odor. And the Rangers, just like that, take the lead with the power ball. And now Cabrera with a double pop out. 
walk bases. We have men on first and second. Mathis grounds out, inning over. Dang it. And we're going to now go to... Uh, there's my setup pitcher. We'll go to Martin. And he allows a single. Strikeout. Single. We got two on. One away. Double play. Inning over. And the Rangers now headed the bottom half of the inning. Caught stealing. Dang it. Playing a little risky right there. And it didn't pan out. So we're going now for another save opportunity now for the Cleric. One, two, and three. And the Rangers win game two. Two to one. Odor, player of the game with a run, uh, home run, the two-run home run that gave the Rangers the win. Bush, 2-1 and one now with a 1.37 ERA and the seventh save for LeClerc. Looking for the save now here in game three against the Houston Astros. I am impressed right now by this pitching staff and the offense coming on, doing what they need to. we got Dallas Keuchel, former Astro, on the bump. Oh, this should be fun, y'all. This should be a fun one. Let's see if Keuchel can shut down his former team here. Does so in the first. The shield is struggling, y'all, at center. Doing nothing for the Rangers right now. No production what speak, to speak of. Spring with a walk. There's a solo home run that Joey Gallo working against Verlander. 1-0 lead for the Rangers. Cabrera on with a single walk from Mazzara. Still just one away. Two runs score on the double from Guzman. Now a line out there from Mathis and DeShields. Nothing going with the Rangers. Drive three across in the third with a 3-0 lead. And Keuchel's still doing his thing beautifully. Single from Elvis. Nothing going for the Rangers there in third. Bregman on. And nothing going for the Astros. Single from Mazzara. Single from Guzman. Fielder's choice. Runners at the corners. Brings up Delino. And Delino scores a run there. 4-0 lead. And the Rangers patting the stats a little bit more here. And there's a walk to begin the inning for Elvis Andrus. Pitching change. We bring, they bring in uh, Valdez right now. And a single from Odor. Pop out from Cabrera. Nomar Mazar up to the plate. Grounds out, inning over. And Keuchel's still doing his thing, man. Oh, man. Keuchel's working a masterful game right now. Griezmann with a single. And fielder's choice from DeShields. A walk from Chu. And a fielder's choice will end the inning. Keuchel's still working right now in the seventh inning. And know your eyes do not deceive you if you look at the hit column. And we're not going to talk about it any more than that. Just look at the line for Houston. And we got a very interesting situation on our hands. There's a walk, strikeout, and another strikeout as Keiko is uh, very close. Pulling off a uh, no-no here, y'all. And the Rangers. Oh, my goodness. Dallas Keiko, y'all. Here we go. Strikeout, ground out, and we are going to go in here with Dallas Keiko. One out away from a no-hitter, ladies and gentlemen, against his former team, the Houston Astros. And we are going to go in here and attempt to do this uh, and hopefully not screw it up. That's the goal. I'm not a great pitcher. I know this. Y'all are probably like, what are you doing? But I want to see this moment. If we can do it, I want to see this moment in the game. And as Alex Bregman is up to the plate, Dallas Keuchel is one out away from a no-hitter here at home against his former squad. And the first pitch is in at the knees, strike one. Holy Toledo, baby. It won't be a perfect game as we have a walk to play. A, 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 I think two, two people. That's hit. No! Stinking A! No! We messed it up. And Keiko does give up a double with two outs in the ninth inning. It was really screwed the whole thing up. Dang it. Bregman with his third double of the year. Oh, man. But what a game Keiko's been having. And they're going to conference right here with a manager. What are they talking about here? The weather? There's a rain delay that lasts about 30 minutes. We'll warm up a fresh arm, why don't we? Good Lord. We'll bring in Sean Kelly. Warm up. Put him in the game, huh? We're going to bring in Sean Kelly now to finish off this game for the Rangers. It's Carlos Correa over three. All right, so Keiko gives us a strong nine and two thirds of hitless baseball. 
The no-hitter is spoiled by a double there with two outs here in the ninth inning as we bring in now Kelly to finish this game out. Rangers leading 4-0. It's not over necessarily because, I mean, this game could get away from us if we don't close this thing out. And as I say that, there's a single runner coming in. Play at the plate too late, and the run does come in to score. Okie dokie. All uh, right. Maybe I should start warming up Leclerc just in case here in a second. So we need to get this out, man. We came in here. We screwed everything up, man. It's my fault. It's all my fault. If we could have just simulated. We would have had a no-hitter for Keiko, and it would have been grand and glorious, but I wanted to see the moment. I wanted to be in the moment, and I screwed it up, and they scored a run, so the hit, the, hit, the uh, no-hitter's gone, and the scoreless game is gone, as that should have ended the game, but it didn't. Last strike now for Houston. And Kelly can't put him away. Swing on that one's done. Ball game over. Rangers sweep the Astros here at home. And Dallas Keuchel gives us a wonderful performance there as our ace with nine and a third. Or eight and, eight and two thirds, excuse me. One hit, one earn, five strikeouts, and three walks. And the Rangers sweep and defeat the Astros, baby. Let's go. Makes me so happy. Keiko player of the game. Again, the eight and two-third. Look at the line. It's magnificent baseball there for us as we now get ready to head on the road against Oakland. And uh, let's look at the division, shall we? We have a lead, ladies and gentlemen. Your Texas Rangers, 9-1 and one in their last 10, 13-8 overall, and have a one-game division lead in the AL West over the 14-11 and 11 Seattle Mariners. Thank you very much. I love it. So we're going to get ready to go on the road here and hopefully keep up this outstanding baseball we've been playing here as of late. Nine out of the last ten again, remember. Uh, it's just very, very, very sound. I love what I'm seeing. Mike Miner on the bump. We're going to give Delano a day off and let uh, – let's – can any of these guys play? Shoot. Uh, Delano, you're not going to get a day off, I suppose. We're going to have to move – well – that sucks. We have a lot of guys really tired. We're going to auto this, auto that, and we'll, we'll see what they do. So Mazzari's in at center, Forsyth in at first. So we got a different lineup for the Rangers here in this game one against the uh, the Athletics. And a single and a single. So two on, two out for Cabrera, and he's thrown out. There's a stolen base, I guess. Somebody got thrown out. Stealing. And the bottom solo home run for Odor. Still getting it done. He's doing very another back-to-back -back Forsyth coming in here getting a home run. 2 nothing Ranger League. And another home run, this time from Mazzara. Three solo shots here in the second inning. And the Rangers are ahead 3 to nothing. Getting it done with the Powerball at the Coliseum. Chapman with a two-out double. Pop up will end it. And let's see if the Rangers can add on with a two on and one away. There's a single runner comes in to score. Odor grounds out. The runners go over to second and third. And a fly out from Forsyth will end it. But a run does come in. It's a 4 nothing Ranger lead. And a run does come in on that single. So far thrown out. It's a 4-1 game. The Rangers still lead. There's a leadoff triple from Mathis, the, tr the catcher. Line out, ground out. Oh, my Lanta. We, we left him stranded. We left him stranded. Chapman with another hit. Three. And Cabrera, Chew, what are we doing here? Double from Pender, walk, uh-oh. Get out of this situation, man, he does. Beautiful pitching right there in defense for the Rangers. And bats are quiet now. Piscotti, there's a single there. Get us out of this inning. Give me six strong two-run bomb. Oh, boy, and the game is spoiled. It's a four-all game now as we move to the seventh inning. And we're going to have to get a new pitcher. We're going to have to go to Martin. And he does his job, and he does it well. So now Blevins comes on here. Cabrera with the leadoff walk. Chu hits into a double play. There's a two-out double from a door. Single brings in the leading run for the Rangers. There's another walk and a ground out, but the Rangers have a one-run lead. A pinch runner caught stealing. Let's go. Uh-oh. I don't like it. I don't like it. Bring in Kimbrell. Get the one out. Strikeout, baby. Let's go. Rangers leading right now by one run. Could definitely use some insurance. Two outs, two on, and a ground out game. Now in the balance here for Leclerc. Strikeout. Strikeout. 
And the game is over, and the Rangers win the opener here against the A's. Odor, two for four with a home run. Two runs and a double as well as Chris Martin gets the win. Leclerc with his eighth save of the season. It's a 5-4 Ranger win. And now we move to game two and hope to continue this outstanding baseball we're seeing right now. We're, I'm loving this, man. I am loving it. Loving it. But I'd love to win by more. Now Smiley's up to the up for the Rangers here. Mathis, a little worn out. We'll give him a day off. Cabrera will give him a day off as well. Odor. Man, we got everybody wanting days off. We got we got look at this lineup. We got Pence, Forsyth, Wisdom, and Bandy all in for the Rangers getting some days. And look at the Shields. Got a day off. New fresh outlook. Comes in and gets a double to start our game off. Too bad he won't come in to score because nobody did anything behind him. That's unfortunate. All right, middle of the line. Let's see how these guys. Two run home run from Mazzara. Mazzara, man, getting done. Guzman, double play, but the Rangers strike first with two runs. There in the second. I'll take it, man. The Shields strikes out, Chu strikes out. Nothing going for the Rangers in the top of the order. Nothing going for them in the bottom of the order. And now we are into the, the pitching groove. The pitchers are feeling themselves. They're doing well now. Uh, we got to break them out of this. Come on. There's a walk. Nothing from him. Okay. Dad gum it. Okay, Forsyth or uh, Smiley, you need to chill out. It's falling apart. And that may be about it. I'm going to let him finish the inning game. Or, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. What am I saying? Look at this. Look, look at this situation. McAllister, do your thing. Good job, McAllister. So the Rangers now let them get four in that inning. It's a 4 2 deficit now. And got the bases loaded two away for Mazzara. And he strikes out. Dad gummit. He strikes out. And another home run for Pendle. Good lord. Can we get something going, Bats, and shut down these Bats for the A's? Gizmo, shut up. My dog my dog is unhappy with the game right now. And I'm unhappy with my team. I have nothing going. Hendricks now coming on. God damn it, man. Like, seriously, what do we got to do here? Martin, come on, man. Our Bats are going to shut the heck down. And we're going to lose. So we lose this second game in the series, 5-2. to two. The win streak's over. First game we've lost in a week. And uh, we head now to game three and look to rebound here. The 14-9 Rangers against these A's still. And we got Lance Land, who's been on fire, on the mound today. And we'll see how the Rangers do. It's top of the order. Still struggling for us, man. There's a leadoff triple. Sack fly brings in the first run of the game. The Rangers are losing three, uh, one nothing. And the bat still can do nothing. There's a walk. Chu. There's Chu bringing in a run, tying this game up. But uh, I don't know what I got to do with the shields, y'all. I may have to move some people around because he is killing us, doing nothing. Go to choice, strikeout. Okay. Bottom of the order is doing nothing for the Rangers. All right. Shields, man, you were killing me, dude. The Shields is a wash. He is not good. There's Gallo with a walk, but a double play. Single from Cabrera. Man, it's going to take some magic to win this game right now. Get out of the inning, Lynn. Dang it. Couldn't get out of the inning. There's a single from the Shields. Can he steal? No, he stinks. You're terrible. You're stinking terrible. And we're in the ninth inning now, trailing by two. There's a home run. Down by one with two outs. And we lose, three to two. That done it. So we've dropped the series to Oakland. And we're now going to head to four on the road against Seattle. Now with a half game lead over these Seattle Mariners. Oh, baby. This should be fun. Uh, so four game series on the road against Seattle. What is going to shape who is the division leader? in the American League West. So this is this is a big series, y'all. We need to win this one here at T-Mobile Park. Got Miller on the bump. Trusting the Shields to wake up. I may have to move him off that leadoff spot. He's not doing good. I know his speed is amazing and all, but if he can't do things, we're not going to have him in there. one nothing lead there. That's it. And look at this situation we found ourselves in. Fielder's choice. The run comes in there on the walk. Another run. Fielder's choice. 
Builders choice, 2-1 lead. Nothing going from you to Shields. You're killing me, Smalls. There's a home run from Cabrera. Tie this bad boy up. There's a walk. Beckham. Oh, we got out of that one. Single from Guzman. Fly out. Double play. That guy. Come on, team. Oh, my Lanta. Good Lord, get out of the inning. All right, got a new pitcher coming in here. Two. Got two on, one away. Strikeout. Single from the Shields. Pence. Ground out, of course. Uh, we need a new pitcher. We're going to go to the pen and bring in here in the seventh. We're going to go to Kimbrell. Allows a leadoff single. Throwing base. And we got out of the inning. New pitcher in now. We got Elvis with a leadoff walk. Two walks now in a row. Sack bunt. Line out. Walk. And a strikeout. Nothing going for the Rangers. Come on, Kimbrell. Come on. All right, we're doing all right. We got a leadoff double there from Mathis. The shield's still garbage. One for five, 0 for four in the second spot. There's a two run coming in from Gallo with a double. Good job, Gallo. Shures up the game, I hope, for us. Now we're going to bring in the closer, Leclerc. And he allows us lead off home run. Oh, my Lord. Four to three game. But we hang on to get the win here in the opener. Gallo, two for three with two walks, two RBIs, and a double. Proves enough for the Rangers to get the win here today. And we are going to change up the lineup here for game two. Uh, as we need to, we need to fix the shields. He's broken as heck, and uh, Keuchel had almost a no hitter to start off last time. Uh, we're gonna move some faces around here. We're gonna move Chu to the leadoff. Uh, we're gonna move Guzman to the two hole. Actually, let's just move everybody down one. All right, there we go. So we're moving the shields all the way to the nine because I have no faith in him <laughs> at all. Uh, yeah, he looks worn out. Well, let's do that then. Mathis, you want a day off too? Elvis, you too? Wow. Everybody needs a day off because we're in the middle of a marathon as a team. There's a walk. Keiko allows the lead man on, but the double play gets him out of it. And the Ranger Bat's doing nothing right now. Stone base there. Shoot. Okay, we got out of that one. There's a walk from Chu, but nothing one from Forsyth. D. Gordon once again gets on. Two for two right now for Seattle. And the Ranger Bats doing nothing, man. Come on, good. All right, still working against King Felix, Bandy, and Pence. Pence gets a single strikeout, though, at the top of the lineup. Nothing going there for Seattle. Forsyth on to begin the inning. Nothing going there for the Rangers. Top of the order goes down in order for Seattle. And Guzman with a one-out Single, there's a fly out, and Pitts walks, so two away for Chu. And Chu brings in a runner at home, but the last one is thrown out, so it's a 1-0 Ranger lead. And now Keuchel has a little bit of room to work with here. Now Ross Cup in for Seattle, gets him down in order. Man, good stuff right now all around for the Rangers, holding to a 1-0 lead. There's a one-out walk, two outs, and a strikeout. Keuchel now working in the ninth, looking for the complete game shutout. And he gets the job done. Unbelievable stuff we're seeing from Dallas Keuchel. Uh, shades of his Cy Young year he had a couple years back. Full, complete game. Four-hit shutout. The Rangers prevail 1-0 as we now look to go back to Mike Miner here today. And hopefully the bats can wake up. If we can get our bats going, our pitching's been solid enough. We're going to be a dangerous team. We really will be. Uh, but we're going to see how this all goes. And we're moving you back down just like we did before. Uh, you're going there. Nope, not there. Mathis, you're not batting leadoff. All right, here we go. Pence, Gallo, boom, 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 boom. All right, that's where we're going to keep this at today. The Shields, what hopefully we'll get things done. Uh, we got Forsyth getting another spot start today. Three. The Shields has got to get going. He's playing awful baseball right now. Um, as are a lot of our bats. A lot of our bats are quiet. Four, four, I'm not liking it. And now we're in trouble. Minor. Wow, two, two run home run after that. Rangers are down in the big way early, four nothing. And the bats have got to wake up. And there's Mathis doing his part. Two runs coming in. The Shields getting it going. Let's see if he can get the, the wheels. Nope, caught stealing. He can't do it. He can't do what I ask him to do. 
And now the Rangers are getting thrashed. And he, you got to get out of it, Mike. If you're getting beat 8 2, you got to suck it up and give me five innings. Maybe six, even. And the, the Rangers aren't going to go home quietly. They're going to fight and battle. And I like what I'm seeing with the innings over. Two do come across. You are terrible, Mike Miner, today. You are absolutely awful. Oh my gosh, our pitcher. All right, we're simulating the whole thing. Get it done. Get it done. I don't care. Rangers, we lose that one 14, a 13 to 4. Terrible game all around for the batting lineup right there. And what we're going to do now is we're going to go quick manage again. I know that y'all, some of you may not like the flow of this episode because we're doing quick manage, but I wanted to get multiple games going. But have a controlled manner of it, you know, at least a little bit uh, by doing the manage like we're doing right now. Gosh, our bats have been terrible the last week and a half. Just awful. I need them to wake up. And one run does come in there for the Rangers, so we do have a one nothing lead, fortunately. The Shields, okay. Double play, dang it. See, that's the stuff I'm talking about, man, where we just get in these bad situations. All right, we got two men on in the corners. Double play, though. See? It's that. Quit hitting it in double plays. And now we're in trouble. We got out of it, but it's a 2-1 lead now for Seattle. I need him to settle down. Three. There's a leadoff double. We're done with him. Come on, Chavez. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention All right, seventh inning. Tied it up. Cabrera with a home run doing his part. There's a two-out walk. And two out double, but nothing going. So here we go. Rangers top of the order. Hit by pitch. Nothing. Dang, man. Kimbrell, come on. Keep them, head, keep, them, keep them where we're at. Kimbrell? You're kidding me right now, man. All right, so here we go. And we lose. And Joey Gallo sustained a knee sprain. And he's going to be out for just a couple days, but the Rangers drop the second game, finish that series at a split. And now that leaves us at a half-game lead still over the Mariners. And we are on the Welcome next to last day now. We have one game left. So what we're going to do, we're going to finish today's episode by finishing Pittsburgh. And what we're going to do today on this, we're going to quick manage. And we're probably going to play like the last – Two innings or so, depending on how this goes. So that's what we're going to try to do here against the Pittsburgh Pirates coming into town. And the Rangers need to wake up and get back in their winning ways on the home field. We're back at home, but we play our best. As you can see, already leading. Got a sack fly two in on the inning, and the Rangers are up 2 nothing, Just like that. Mazzara, double. Okay, another run in for the Rangers. A 3 nothing lead. Now a leadoff double from Chu. A walk from Forsyth. There's a double play. Dang it. Another double play. We've hit some more double plays lately. And I can count. Sack fly run comes in. But we're out of the inning with just one across. Single there from Kramer. Oh no, Moran. But Moran. And run comes in there on that. Get out of the inning. Thank you. Okay, so one run came in there. It's a 3-2 game now for the Rangers. Still leading. Lance Lynn, give me a strong sixth inning here. Oh, that's it. We're done. Kelly, come on, get the out. Thank you. Solo home run from Mazar makes this back to a 4-2 game for the Rangers. As we head to the bottom of the seventh, or top of the seventh, excuse me, for Kelly. Two singles will be the end of him. Martin, come on in. Well, we're tied now. Come on, Rangers. Two on, two out. Fielder's choice. Oh, my gosh. Kimbrell's going to come in now in the eighth. And we're going to enter the game now here in a tie game situation in the eighth inning. Here in the last game of April, the Rangers still leading the division right now by a half game, but need to finish this one strong and finish the month at 17-12. and 12. And I think that would be a major success as we are now, if we don't win, we're going to be behind the Mariners. The Mariners won their game. We need to win and stay ahead. As we will try to do just and that here. Kimbrell in the game now for the Rangers. The first pitch is across, strike one. Looking for the toughest one to get in the cycle, the triple. Well, this guy needs a triple for the cycle, they said. Somebody did. Even though it says he's 0 for 2, so I don't believe it. <laughs> I don't believe it a bit. 0-2 count. 
Swing and a miss through the knuckle curve, and down goes out number one here in the eighth inning. It's a 4 4 time. First pitch in, and that is Hut hits, and that's going to think it down there. It does right in front of the Shields in center. That's a one out single for Pittsburgh. And we got a pinch runner coming in now, Kevin Newman. Colin Moran to the plate. Newman's got pretty good speed overall. We're watching you over there, man. We're watching you. I'm aware. Try to, try to keep him honest because I notice that speed. I don't want them getting in a situation where they get ahead on us. And that's ooh, borderline pitch. We didn't get the benefit of the doubt right there. And we get that one in there. Strike one, two, one count. I'm being very aware of this guy over there at first. Ooh. Don't want to forget Didn't about get him. It. We're good. Possible go ahead runs on first, one away. And this is and got it in there on the corner. 2-2 two, two count. Kimbrough looking for the K. Two two or possibly a double play. Runners off for second. Runner going. Play in that second, and he is safe at second, but swinging through strike three. So two away now in the inning. And that brings up Starling Marte to the plate. Leading run at second. 97 mile per hour heater right down the middle of the plate. Very fortunate that wasn't connected with. We missed one. And that swung on and missed again. Strike two. And the Rangers looking to head to the bottom half of the inning tied. And he will with another K for Kimbrell. Get the job done, doing his job well. And the Rangers got an opportunity no here to go here take the lead here in the eighth. Newman in now at second, and Castillo in for the Pirates. And now bring up Odoro for three. Struck out working last time up in the sixth. And begin the eighth inning. That's hit high. That's hit deep, and no doubt about it, ladies and gentlemen. First pitch swinging all the way to the concession, it looks like, right there. Logan and Odor. Getting the job done for the Rangers and giving us a one-run lead here in the bottom of the eighth. And that was a absolute mash, no doubt about it, pitch for Odor. Absolutely hammered to right field. Look at this. Look at this swing. Cacao. No doubt about it, baby. I love it. All right, we have Cabrera to the plate now after that solo bomb giving the Rangers the lead. We really need to warm up our uh, closer now, Cleric. Let's go do that real quick. Let's go manager, bullpen. Get the man up and ready. Oh, man, I felt good off the bat. I love it. I love it. That's grounded foul. Slider ran in. It's an 0-2 count. Here we go, oh, baby. And that's hit up the middle base knock. Let's go. Let's go. 0-2 count, single. That's a great start to the inning. Home run, single for the Rangers. We can start to continue this offense now with Nomar Mazzara here against Castillo. And slider, good pitch, good placement. I guarantee if I were to try to swing at that, I would have mashed that into the ground and popped it up. One of the two. I wouldn't have been a, wouldn't have been a hit. And that's another base knock. It looks like gets over the head. Two on, no one out. Mazzara with a single there. The Rangers bats are grooving here in the bottom of the eighth. Gizmo, shut up. Now, excuse my dog. Guzman to the plate. Up the middle, off the foot. And they're going to be able to turn two, I think. No, they weren't. That went up the middle, off the foot there of the pitcher. And they did, they were able to get one. 
Now we have runners at the corners and just one away. And I'm sorry, I apologize, y'all, for my dog there. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I should not have swung it. I fouled off a pitch that could have hit me in the thigh. Oh, one count now for Mathis. And that's gonna be a double play that ends the thing. Dad, gum it! What a beautiful situation we have ourselves in. But instead, it's a one-run lead. After the home run there for Ordor, we're going to bring in the closer to Clark to finish this game and give the Rangers the win here. Nine innings, giving up one run. That's nine uh, saves. So it's been very, very efficient for us. Looking to shut them down here at home. And the first pitch is fouled on. Behind the play, the uh, behind plate. So let's see here. We can do now the second pitch of the changeup. Swing and a miss on the changeup. And now the 0-2 count. Let's get, let's get, let's get right here. Swing and a miss. Strike three. Down goes out number one. Rangers looking to finish this month in first place in a year where we thought we were rebuilding. A couple key additions. Great pitching we've been seeing overall. Uh, timely hitting as well, and the Rangers find themselves in a situation where we may be competing sooner than we actually thought, and I love it. Good young developments all around with some key veteran uh, leadership in here, and there's another swing and a miss, strike three. Down he goes swinging, and that is two away. It's now Gregory Polanco to the plate. Two for four today in this game with two singles. All that stands between the Rangers and a victory here to end this month. And that swung on, makes this count even at one. Slider in, we'll keep it right here. Miss, oh my gosh, he swung, you're disgusting. Oh my lord. And now we can look to ring him up, let's throw it all. Swing and a miss, we strike off the side with the Cleric and the Rangers win this one here at home to begin their two-game series with Pittsburgh and end the month of April with a winning record and a share or at least an outright lead in the American League West. And Mazar, 3 for 4 the home run as the player of the game, even though I'd probably give it to Odor for that one monster home run he hit there to give us the lead. But nonetheless, the Rangers win the game. Getting off, we're getting off to the right foot at home. We've been playing very, very good baseball at home, y'all, overall. And uh, Michael Sanchez is a little bit hurt, but we're okay. Look at that, a half game lead in the division now for the Rangers as we finish our first month in the books. We're gonna look at the stats right now again. The Shield's struggling right now. Uh, Chu's been struggling as of late. Elvis has been very solid for us. Forsyth has been doing a pretty good job out for us in left field as Gallo still harboring a little bit of an injury. Odor, okay. Uh, Cabrera, very, very good for Cabrera right there. I expect more out of Mazar right there. Uh, uh, Guzman RBIs. needs to get some power Being going a little bit here, and Mathis, um, Mathis and Bandy at catcher, both struggling immensely. So we need to fix those areas right there. Let's go look at the pitching of the first month. The Michael, excellent numbers for us, two and one. Minor uh, needs to improve right now. He's been struggling. Smiley as well. Uh, solid numbers there from Lance Lynn and Shelby Miller, also starting to really get it going. And then the bullpen's been pretty solid overall. Cleric solid. Kimbrel as well. Martin as well. Kelly. McAllister, Bush. I mean, you look at the you look at the bullpen. They're solid through and through. I'm very very pleased with what we're seeing. Now let's go look at the guys in double and triple A of all the prospects we have here. Brian Fagan, 313, doing very very well for himself. Um, Hunter Falefa, look at him doing good and maybe see him back up in the pros sooner rather than later. I do hope. Triple uh, A Jernigan, that Craig, uh, Colin Craig right there doing his thing. William Winograd. Victor Jones struggling still. Victor Jones really needs to wake it up. Nico Del Toro crushing the ball right now. Linder struggling, just as is uh, Talbot struggling. So a lot of Rangers are struggling right now in Double A. So we go now look at pitchers. We got Morgan Steinle, uh, Steinle, uh, one and two right now. Three ERA. Broadhead really not doing very well. The ERA at 6.38. Matthew Cox doing pretty well for himself. But the Rangers overall, y'all, we're doing fine. We have a lead in the division through the first month. And that's where we're going to end today's episode for Franchise Mode with the Texas Rangers. If you enjoy the content, as always, leave a huge thumbs up, comment down below with your feedback, tips, and suggestions. And if you want to see more, click the notification bell and subscribe button so you never miss out on any future content. Any help us reach our growing goal of 2,000 subscribers. But I thank you all so much for making this video part of your day. Have an outstanding 
rest of your day, ladies and gents, and I'll see you all back here in the next video. Y'all take it easy.